Hello, this is Matt Natove, Executive Editor of Plastics Technology Magazine. I'm here uh, in Schwertberg, Austria, at the home of Engel Machinery, where they are doing their pre-K uh, press tour. We've had quite a full day, including a tour of their expanded manufacturing facility and their new technical center, and we covered a host of topics that they will be presenting at the K, uh, starting with uh, lightweight composite technologies for automotive. They're going to have a demonstration of molding three different uh, continuous fiber woven uh, samples that will be molded into and over molded in a, in a door frame, and uh, it's going to use two different ovens and three robots to, uh, to manufacture this part. Um, in addition, they're going to th present their new and improved amorphous metal manufacturing press, which has greatly reduced the cycle time uh, from several minutes down to about 70 seconds. And for the first time ever, they're going to show amorphous metal overmolded with LSR in a separate press. In addition, they're going to show roll-to-roll in-mold decorating with a haptic touch surface. They're going to show uh, molding a light guide for LED lighting with very, very fine surface details to show off the precision capabilities of their uh, tie barless presses. They're going to use multi-layer technology that's been used to mold very thick lenses, but this time to mold a two-component polypropylene part uh, using a spring stack mold that will have eight cavities and four rotary positions, molding a clear component, cooling it, mold, over molding a colored component, and cooling that before they eject it. Uh, in addition, they're going to be uh, introducing new control technologies in their IQ, Intelligent Quality Series, um, they have uh, a new thing called IQ Melt Control, which helps optimize the cycle. Uh, there is something called IQ Process Observer, which analyzes the, the process to uh, make for faster troubleshooting. And they're going to introduce more IQ technologies, at least in developmental form, at the K show. In addition to everything else, uh, Engel will be showing two technologies aimed at the so-called circular economy to help make plastics more sustainable. Uh, one will be, they will be showing a version of a sandwich molding process in which the center of the part is all recycled material. They call that skin melt. They've done some advances in the technology there to reduce the cycle time and give the molder more control over the proportions of skin and core layers. And then something else interesting is they're, they've developed their IQ weight control program to uh, allow for use of recycled materials that have inherently more variable uh, melt viscosity. And since their technology adjusts for difference in melt viscosity, it'll make it much easier to deal with higher levels of regrind. As I say, there are quite a number of technologies developed here. I don't even know if that's a complete list, but that's enough for now. You'll see more in our pre-K, uh, our K preview issue, I should say, in September. Thank you.